What up, YouTube? You can't stop trading and investing with James Z. I just wanted to do a quick update on NNDM. Um, all these bullish flags we was talking about, man, um, after hours, it broke it. As I said uh, earlier, boom, boom, bull flag pop broke. Boom, boom, bull flag, and now it's breaking 680s in the 680s now. Um, exactly like I explained um, with the technical analysis video I did yesterday. Um, so again, man, NNDM um, poised for a breakout over the 739s. Um, and I see that coming sometime either tomorrow or the next day. Um, today is Wednesday, so it's either going to happen uh, Thursday or Friday. Um, again, man, very bullish on NNDM. Um, I just wanted to show the video real fast of um, exactly, exactly how the bull flag works. Um, and as I stated, we've seen it multiple times. Um, we've seen it multiple times happen already. Um, like I stated when we've seen it here on this day, boom, boom, pop. We've seen it here, boom, boom, came back, popped. And then I told you in the last video, I was seeing a bullish flag forming. And then now we had a pop in the after hours. So NNDM um, still, still looking very bullish. And I do see this breaking the 739s either tomorrow or Friday. Uh, for me personally, um, it is still very much a buy in the 660 area, in the 660s, um, anywhere in this area right now before the breakout. Because once it breaks out, the next resistance level is at um, 7, 792 in the 790s. So, you know, if you do the math and you buy in um, now, um, um, that's about a dollar profit. So again, I'm not a financial advisor. I'm just the guy that likes researching stocks from technical analysis, fundamental analysis, and every aspect of uh, the stock market that I could find um, as far as uh, analysis goes. Data analytics, statistical analysis, all of the above, trading and investing psychology, man. You gotta utilize all your information to formulate some kind of plan. And as I said, my plan was either to exit in the 550s or, um, you know, exit somewhere uh, in the breakouts of the 8 to 9 range, depending on what it does there. And then ultimately, the range I'm trying to get in is in the 14s. Um, and that's ultimately the range I would like to exit at. So just a quick update on NMDM. We see one bull flag pop uh, the other day. Boom, this was on, what, the 30th? Um, so we see one bull flag pops. Uh, we see a, another bull flag on the 20 day, one hour chart. One, two, three, and three days pops. And then again, one, two, three, three days pops. So we're starting to see a pattern within the technicals of bull flags. Every time a bull flag forms in the recent time right now, it has a pop. So um, again, just wanted to update y'all on NNDM. Looking really bullish to break that 739 mark sometime soon. Um, and then catch me in the 8s and 9s and the 14s. So just a quick update on NNDM. Bullish, bullish, bear flag popping. You feel me? That's what we're going to call this. Bullish, bullish, bear flag popping. You feel me? So um, just wanted to do a quick update on that um, and, and on the technicals. Just to show you that, you feel me, when you do recognize these kind of patterns, when you have a stock that is, um, uh, when you have a stock that's hyped up, um, uh, cause you always gotta look at where this, where the company is. So the company is a, a, a 3D printing company. Um, you know, the technology is great for the time and era that we're in in life right now. Um, and so you want to look at that. You want to look at the fundamentals like the last video, um, gradual climbing. You want to look at the chart pattern, gradual climbing, and you want to look at the volume and the supply and demand ratio. Um, the volume was a little bit lower um, than yesterday's volume, slightly lower, but we're still in this bullish pattern. And I believe once it breaks this, um, we're going to see a pickup in volume again, just like we see here. Um, you know, the volume faded and then boom, when it broke out, volume picked up volume faded and i believe once it uh breaks out getting close to a breakout um 
uh, we will see the volume pick up again. So, you know, it's just all these catalysts that lead um, to, it's not just the chart pattern. It's a multiple of different catalysts that lead to my decision making from fundamental, from technical, um, to the news catalyst, um, to the supply and demand ratio and who's involved in the stock. Um, and then and then you can make your decision. So everything I seen um, in all catalysts were very bullish. And so when you start to see this flag form, I mean, it's a good indicator will pop if every catalyst is bullish. And then as we've seen here in a three day, then it popped and then we see it form form again here and now it's popping. So just a quick update on NNDM. Um, I see it breaking new highs coming really soon, uh, potentially in the next couple of days. So you feel me? Um, that's it for today. If you watch this video, please click that like button. Please subscribe. I very much appreciate it. You can't stop mafia as a mindset movement, which means never stop your progress, never stop your knowledge. Always educate yourself, especially in finance. You feel me? And uh, always look for multiple streams of income, including the stock market. And I'm here to bring all the knowledge possible that I have, not only for myself, but for others. I like to educate myself every day on finance and please educate yourself. So uh, that's it for right now. I uh, just want to do a quick update on NNDM. You feel me? And their bullish flags popping. Bullish flags popping. You feel me? So that's going to be it for today. Till next time. Peace.